When it comes to gaming culture, many are unaware that it even exists. Many others are not sure as to what the direct definition of gamer means, or the different types of gamers, for those like myself, who play video games. And many other people still believe in the stereotypes plagued upon our hobby. Today, I hope to not only debunk some of those stereotypes, but to hopefully inform some of those who may not necessarily know much about the medium. For starters, the direct definition of gamer is someone who likes to play games, especially video or computer games. That means, by definition, even though gamer is highly associated with video games, if you play any kind of game, whether it be a board game or a card game, you're considered a gamer. It's just an in general definition for those who like to play games. In addition, when it comes to people like myself who play video games, there are a couple of slang terms to identify the types of gamers, if you will. The two most common are hardcore and casual gamer. A hardcore gamer is just someone who is really involved in the news, the medium, and devotes a significant amount of their time and interest into the medium. However, a casual gamer is someone who has a limited interest or time devoted to the hobby of gaming. They're someone who might pick up the occasional game once in a while, or only get the big blockbuster releases, such as Call of Duty or Halo, as some of you might have heard of. But when it comes down to it, the main difference between a hardcore and casual is that one has a little bit more of an interest or a little more time devoted to the hobby than the other. Finally, I am sick and tired of the stereotypes associated with our culture. Some of them involve something like gamers are automatically unattractive, that we are just teenage boys and men-child who like to play video games, and that's all we are. Well, you'll imagine to my dismay, as one of my fellow gamers happens to be my female middle-aged married landlord of my apartment. That's just to give you an idea of the widespread demographic that gaming can reach to. It's not associated with just a small amount of people or crowd. It can reach to anyone who is just interested in playing video games. Because when it comes down to it, the definition of gamer is very broad, and the types of gamers don't really mean anything. On top of that, the stereotypes are completely false, because when it comes down to it, all a gamer is, is someone who just likes to enjoy a hobby like myself that is no different than any other hobbies out there. And I hope everyone can see eye to eye on that. Thank you for your time.